Speaker, this question is to the Minister of Māori Development and asks, does he stand by all his statements? Uh, the Honourable Chris Finlayson. On behalf of the Minister for Māori Development, yes. Uh, Submit a question for the man who always gets the words perfect. Order. Order. <laughs> member will resume his seat. My patience will not last too much longer with the member. Rise and ask a question, supplementary question, in line with standing orders. Point of order, Speaker. Point of order, the Speaker, right honourable Winston Peters. Uh, it was for you to make that correction, not him. That's why I pointed out to him. Order. Mm -hmm. I'll give the member one more chance, but it'll be brief, to rise and ask his supplementary questions. Supplementary question, the right honourable Winston Peters. Uh, can I ask the minister, does he stand by his statement yesterday, and I quote him, we've got the platform right. I think we are in the right space. End of quotes. If so, why? The Honourable Chris Finlayson. On behalf of the Minister for Māori Development, yes. S supplementary question to the Minister question, for Māori Development. Supplementary question, the Right Honourable Winston Peters. <laughs> does, he think it, does he think it's fair to say that he commissioned a report costing taxpayers over $20,000 to defend his position that Fano Aura is producing results despite that report not containing any hard data which the Prime Minister admitted yesterday. The Honourable Chris Finlayson. On behalf of the Minister for Māori Development, this is hopeless. That is a question that should be directed to the Minister of Fano Aura. Supplementary question. Supplementary question. Supplementary question, right Honourable Winston. Can I ask the Minister for Māori Development as to whether he will ensure next time that he cannot answer the question he gets someone proficient to do the job rather than come down here and act like a clown. <laughs> I'll, in, I'll invite... Please. Order. Please. Order. Order. I'll invite the Minister to answer it if he so wishes. The, the Honourable Chris Finlayson. On behalf of the Minister for Māori Development, I will if he promises not to have late nights at the Green Parrot before formulating his Order. questions. Order. 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 Before order, I w order. Will the member please resume his seat? The member's calling a point of order and I'll hear it, but before I do hear it, I just want to say if the member asks a supplementary question like that, he can anticipate he'll get an answer like he did get. Does the member want to raise a point of My order? My point of order is very simple. Point of order, the right on uh, That sort of answer is likely to lead to two things. Disorder, disorder and the worst of personal retaliation. Order. Order. And that's... Order. That's exactly the... That's... That's exact. That's ex... Order. I'm on my feet for the benefit of Mr Farford. That's exactly the point I was making when the member asked that supplementary question. Further supplementary? Don't get sarcastic to me. Do your bloody job, Speaker. If you can't order. take it, order. don't dish it out, Sunshine. Order. bloody Speaker I've ever had. Order. Again, the mayor... Order. I'll invite the member now to, raise his, uh, to ask a supplementary question, but he's to do it within the bounds of standing orders. Always do. Supplementary question. Always do. Jerry that. Supplementary question to the Minister for Maori Development. Which is, better, which is a better use of taxpayer funding? 20,000 spent through Fana Ora on Dunedin gang members to buy cannabis, over 60,000 for the Otaki Maori Club for a one day holy. Or 140 million on 2,750 more nurses in our hospitals, 2,725 more primary school teachers in our schools, or 2,360 more police officers protecting our streets from crime. Yeah. 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 Honourable Chris Finlayson. On behalf of the Minister for Maori Development, that is a question that should be directed to the Minister of Fana Ora. He's been here for almost 40 years off and on. You'd think order, he'd know order, about order, asking questions. The latter part will not help the order of this house.